Hey guys, Danny Johnson here, and if your truck is only blowing air out of the top vents or just the defrost, then you may need to look at the heater blend door actuator. So under here, just remove this piece of air duct, and uh, then you'll find it up in here. It's this motor right here, and it's very easy to remove. It just has two uh, screws. There's one here I've already got almost all the way removed, and one at the top. And so these are kind of tricky because it's an odd size. It's a 5.5 millimeter socket that you'll need. Otherwise you'll strip it. So uh, it's not a very common size that comes in kits. You may have to go find that size. And uh, so anyway, you'll just remove those two and then simply unplug it here, just like that. And you'll pull the whole assembly down and it'll still have the shroud on the back. And the shroud will catch the blend door uh, lever and be changing that so um, I'll show you what this looks like here in the meantime if you don't have your new one to put in you can manually turn that lever that's up in there so you'll you'll see this white lever as you push it back and forward you can control where the air is uh, venting to so you can do that in the meantime uh, so anyway this is what it looks like it's pretty simple and uh, also, if you're having problems with it only going hot or only blowing out cold air, one or the other, I can also show you how to do the uh, blend door for the hot or cold. And so it's located on that little hump, uh, pretty much on the floor between the driver and the passenger side. So anyway, pretty uh, easy to get to for both of these. And if you have any questions, let me know. Uh, check the video description. I'll try to put some part numbers in there for you. Thanks, guys.